main principle of Mercia School is essentially to ensure that we do the things that everyone's always done, but do it well. That's what matters, and consistently well at that. Well, as I come to school, I walk to school. I am meeting by the teachers at the gates. We would just say, good morning, sir. Maybe he might just do our tie quickly, just to ensure we're looking smart for school. We would get to the family space, go to our lockers, get our books for the day, and then when the bell goes, we go to our lineup positions. On Fridays, we were doing Victus, and we would recite that poem. And it serves as a reminder that their choices and their destinations are in their own hands. And the last two sentences in that poem, um, being the master of their fate and the captain of their soul, um, just reminds them that we can give them great teachers, we can have the atmosphere that we have here, but they've got to grab it. It makes you feel almost powerful, like you're ready for the day. And whatever, whatever comes towards you, anything bad or good, you take it on the chin and you carry on. I am the master of my fate. I am the captain of my soul. So we all have the same uniform. We have the blazer and then we all have either skirts or trousers and um, quite plain, simple shoes. It makes us feel like we're more part of a community and that um, no one's different because they couldn't afford a specific um, clothing item, like we're all the same. We to ensure our equipment's all working, three green pens, three black pens, ruler, calculator, protractor, compass, everything we need basically. They're given to us in a list so we know what we need. We all we know how to polish our own shoes and pack our own bags and tie our own ties and then in the morning during lineup, our teachers check our uniform to make sure that um, it's as good as it can possibly be. I mean, we have granola, <laughs> cornflakes, we have, we used to have Rice Krispies, now we have Cheerios with green milk. I mean, I prefer blue milk, but it's also all right. We ensure that our teachers teach from the front, that they have a superb knowledge of their subject, and we also ensure that they insist on high expectations. And as a result, our, our children flourish. They um, enjoy their learning, they do lots of reading, they do lots of writing, and as a result, they learn bucket loads, and, and, and that's important for their futures, so they can then have opinions of the world because they have those important facts. My favourite thing about learning at Mercia is um, the fact that we're, always, that we're always striving to be the best at that subject as we can. We uh, absolutely drive for our children to go to the very best universities in this country. If they choose to do so, to achieve that aspiration, they have to do well at school. They have to get good GCSEs and good A-levels. And we give them every chance. We give them classrooms where behaviour is superb. We give them excellent teachers, but our children they grab it with both hands because they have the character traits to be successful and that is also part of this school. Our school motto is Gienti Unis Scammers, which means we are united by knowledge. So we have silent corridors to ensure that there's no bullying or um, rude behaviour and it also maximises our learning time so we get 59 minutes of learning instead of, I don't know, 50 like you might get in other schools. Our philosophy for the building is one where movement is calm and silent, with a high staff presence. This keeps pupils safe. There is nowhere to hide or to bully another pupil. I think the way they've designed the corridors is definitely to maximise our learning time. At Mercia, we um, have a family lunch uh, experience where all our children, they sit with their teachers and they serve each other and they talk about the topic of the week. Everybody is included, nobody's left out. Um, the people at the end of the table will serve the food and hand it down to the end of the table and then we have enriched conversations about a specific topic and um, we all just sit together and um, no one's like left out. And then after lunch, after they've cleaned their plates and they've cleaned their tables, they show gratitude to each other, um, showing appreciation to their teachers or maybe to their mothers. I would like to show my appreciation to all the Mercia staff who rang home during lockdown, uh, which ensured us that our teachers were there for us during lockdown and showed the sense of community in Mercia. Thank you, Mercia staff. <laughs> Yeah, it makes you really appreciate 
what nice things that people have done for you which most of the time people don't really recognise. Um, we have no packed lunches. We um, want an inclusive family feel and so we all eat the same. Chef, chef is an amazing guy. I never had a chef before in school, but <laughs> if, if I had a chef in my mind, that would be him. Successful people and nice people and that's important to us. And so our lunchtime experience is all about those, those skills required to be successful in life. Our longer school day absolutely ensures that we have that rounded education for children. We get an hour of enrichment which helps us follow our passions and like follow stuff that we wouldn't normally follow in a normal school. So there's a massive there's a massive range of subjects you can do. Music, sports, drama and dance, as well as classroom-based activities such as poetry and debate are all part of the Mercy offer. Yeah, I really, they're really enjoyable because they give you an experience that you wouldn't normally get to do outside of school. But it like broadens your experiences and lets you do stuff that you've never done before. So at the end of the day, we either get an hour of self-study, which is independent learning and revision. They do help us, but they're trying to, they're also trying to help us develop our own skills so we can study independently. So in the future, we'll be able to revise and we can do it by ourselves. That five o'clock finish absolutely enables us to embrace those opportunities and those flexibilities within the day. Yeah, Mercy is like a spark, I think. It's like a spark in the woods. It first starts a spark, then it went to like a fire. Then that fire turned to a wildfire, and now it's spreading its influence around everybody else and all the people in Mercy School. Mercy School is, is, is a school for all children, all children from all backgrounds. We absolutely believe that everybody should be treated the same and consistently so. We even go down to the detail at Mercia of everyone having the same school bag because we don't want anybody to be ridiculed for, for what they have or what they can afford. We are part of the same Mercia family. I always believe that you can never, never um, measure somebody's aspiration by the size of their house. And when they come to this school, we drive every child to be the best that they can be. Mercia is about securing your child's future. Aspiring to achieve the things that they didn't think was possible. That's the Mercia way. When my friends think, oh, you're going to that school, that's like a prison. What are you, what are you doing, mate? What are you doing? I'm thinking, no, 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 no. My future is going to be based on what Mercia has taught me and that I can really find my full potential at Mercia to ensure I have a good future, provide for my mom and my, my, mom and my sister, my little brother, everybody.